Throughout the 60s and 70s, cops hunted down key figures of the Dixie Mafia, including its enigmatic ringleader, Kirksey Nix. I'm interested in making money. I'm not interested in hurting people. Fifteen years into Kirksey's life sentence, the Dixie Mafia was practically folklore, but that would soon change. I'm Jed Lipinski. This is Gone South, a documentary podcast from C-13 Originals, a Cadence 13 studio. Season 2, The Dixie Mafia. Available now on the Odyssey app or wherever you get your podcasts. I'm Justin Ho with the Marketplace Minute. Stocks closed higher after the Labor Department reported better-than-expected jobs numbers. The Dow closed up one-third percent, with the S&P 500 and the Nasdaq up half a percent. Wall Street is closed on Friday for Independence Day. The economy added 4.8 million new jobs in June. The unemployment rate fell to just over 11 percent. Leisure and hospitality jobs made up almost half of today's gains. Manufacturing and retail added jobs as well. But nearly 18 million people are still unemployed, and some economists caution that increasing coronavirus infections will put a halt to any job growth. The Congressional Budget Office said Thursday that the jobless rates will end the year at 10.5 percent. U.S. trade continues to show weakness through the pandemic. The Commerce Department said U.S. exports fell 4.4 percent in May. The trade deficit is at its widest since 2018. I'm Justin Ho with the Marketplace Minute.